Today on Animal Fact Files, we're discussing eel pouts. As you can probably guess, eel pouts get their common name from their eel-like appearance. These fish have a long body with long dorsal and anal fins that are directly connected to their tail fin. Most eel pouts are dark in color, with even darker heads, but some are also cream-colored. With over 250 classified species, there are differences in appearance and behavior within this fish family. Also, as a side note, the fish commonly known as the burbot is also sometimes called an eel pout, but it's not closely related to the eel pouts we're discussing today. More than half of the known eel pout species live in the ocean's depths. They're most commonly found between 1,600 and 4,000 feet below sea level but they range from intertidal coastal habitats down to the trenches at 3.3 miles deep. These fish are most commonly seen in benthic habitats, or along the ocean's bottom, but some species are mesopelagic, meaning they swim in the open ocean. Eel pouts are tolerant of cold water, and most live in temperatures under 46 degrees Fahrenheit. However, some species live in hydrothermal vents where the temperature can be much higher. Generally, these fish live in cold, temperate to polar waters, but they're found around the world. Those living in Arctic waters have even been observed in brackish environments, and some species are known to breathe air. Some eel pouts only reach 5 inches in length, while others can be more than 3 feet long, though on average they're less than half this length. There are also eel pouts with green bones. This doesn't stop predators from eating them, though. Eel pouts fall prey to larger, bottom-dwelling fish. When threatened, they're believed to roll up into a spiral shape and float down to the sea floor. In turn, eel pouts eat worms, crustaceans, gastropods, and bivalves. Because a majority of species live deep below the ocean's surface, little is known about the breeding habits of all species. Some, like those living in coastal habitats, give birth to live young that develop for three to four months inside the female's body. Others lay eggs in shallow depressions in muddy bottoms. Typically, fewer than a dozen eggs are laid at a time, and they're relatively large. It's believed that the eggs are guarded until they hatch three to four months later. For more facts on eel pouts, check out the links below. Give a thumbs up if you learned something new today. Thank you to our patrons, Spike Spiegel 93 Dad, and everyone else for their support of this channel. And thank you for watching Animal Fact Files.